But, you know, it's like, and I just, you know, what am I going to laugh? You know, I don't really think it's funny, but I don't think it's so sad. I just live with it, you know? People, all people have their own quirks or whatever it is. So she had some preconceived ideas about me. And based on that, I, now I got some preconceived ideas about her. I lived in Queens, which is not that far, right? But it was kind of far from here. It was, you know, not far from projects. It was a lower middle class kind of a, a ghetto and a very rough neighborhood. It's the number one heroin uh, distribution uh, area in Queens. So for me, um, yeah, there's a huge difference in this environment and that one. And you see how we beat these kids four in a row? Me and my man Brett. I just stunk it up. I didn't perform well. You know, my background is better than that. <laughs> my, my history is, is better than that. I just didn't perform up to it. Matt's a, Matt is a big lawyer in the music business. He often got all about the ghetto, so he didn't really have the flavor and wasn't able to bring the ball to the hoop the way he learned in the, in the hood. You know, I think he'd been living in the Hamptons too long, and, and, you know, my man Trace got too much money, entirely too much money. He spent more time counting his money than laying the ball up, so he really couldn't miss it. And me and Brett are still hungry. You know, obviously, so we, we let them have it, remind them where they came from, took them back to the hood for a minute and schooled them. All right, I can't let this go on anymore. The reason why they won is because Russell said he would send me some more business. <laughs> so I'll tell you like that. Well, Russell, Russell's been a client now for four or five years, and, you know, I want him, we want him to continue to feel good about working with us. <laughs> so, you know, we, you know, maintained that ego that he has and did the right thing. He knows, it, but it's good though, you know, at that age, with all that money, you know, to be in that that kind of shape. It's good, <laughs> all right, all right. So we got footage. You you got some black people in the Hamptons, right? If you're not VIP, you're not getting in. I no. looked at her. No. She looked at me. We're getting in, and we were, we're like, we're in. in. Your summer in the Hamptons will continue here on ABC. she's been, everything she is, and everything you'll be together. The Three Stone Anniversary Ring. For your past, present, and future. A diamond is forever. Wouldn't it be perfect if you could cook sausage in under a minute that tastes like fresh cooked? Now you can. Jimmy Dean Fresh Taste Fast Sausage. Now in Country Maple Spicy Blend and Southwest Style Grill. Fresh Taste Fast. Guaranteed. and counting. The 210 horsepower supercharged Nissan Xterra. Everything you need, nothing you don't. She once worshipped the sun. She believed laugh lines were a part of living. Fight damage with new Olay Intensive Restoration Treatment. It helps restore the appearance of time-worn skin with its blend of vitaniacin and the most concentrated pro-retinol available over the counter. Zoning in to fight past damage on forehead, eyes, cheek, mouth, where you need it most. New Olay Total Effects Intensive Restoration Treatment. Totally love the skin you're in. What are hamburger lovers saying about the new BK Back Porch Grillers? Whoa, doggone dang tastes like it's homemade. Double hamburger. Tastes like it's straight up the grill. Airplane broiled a la parrilla. That's a good burger. I think I found a new burger. It's like nothing I've ever had before. It tastes just like I made it. And I'm a pretty good cook. It's awesome. You gotta try this. One bite? Burger King introduces two delicious new Back Porch Grillers. The BK Smokehouse Cheddar and the BK Homestyle. Burgers your way. You got it. You've got a black ops agent who's off the reservation. If we don't take care of this, we will both burn. They're trying to kill me. They trained him. Buckle up. Then betrayed him. If we stay here, we die. And on June 14th... What are you gonna do? I'm gonna make it stop. No one is more dangerous. <laughs> Matt Damon is Jason Bourne. I'm on my own side now. <laughs> the Bourne Identity. Rated PG-13. At theaters Friday, June 14th. 
Millions of women can afford to use professional hair care products thanks to Tresemme. Professional products without the salon price. You don't have to spend a fortune for professional quality. Try Tresemme Natural Shampoo and Conditioner with 100% natural extracts and now twice the vitamins A, C, and E. Keeps hair strong and healthy. Tresemme, Tresemme, Professional, affordable Tresemme. You, my friend, are robusto. You crave a rich, zesty sauce with a big, juicy tomatoes. You, fool, are in trouble. <laughs> but you are still robusto, baby. Ragu Robusto. Eat life up. Tuesday, ABC's Ultimate Spy Game continues. The mole is going to play dirty. Mole 2. Two episodes back-to-back. -back, Tuesday at 8, 7 central on ABC. Ever wish you could change your life? Hi, I'm Travis. I sell doors. Boring. Travis Glass did. I'd just like to go back and do it over knowing what I know now. But you know what they say. Be careful what you wish for because you just might get it. That was them coming to ABC. Bad Boy versus Rockefeller softball game. Obviously, Puffy and Jay Z and Damon Dash will be here. Aaliyah's playing Natani, Tara Reed, a lot of social people. It should be really fun. I think this is a really good example of what the Hamptons is all about. We have a lot of business in the Hamptons. We do a lot of events. We do a lot of parties. I represent clubs. We do all sorts of things. I take off Fridays in the summer to work from the Hamptons. I actually don't take off. From Memorial Day to Labor Day, I work 24-7. Uh, we represent two clubs annually, Conscience Point and Jetties. Memorial Day, you'll find tons and tons of people, but July 4th is really when I feel the summer kicks off. It's, it's, everyone's like, the summer should be easy. The summer's the hardest part of my life. I was, I was inside uh, a walkie-talkie. I was called by one of the security guys. Uh, we need somebody of higher authority out here, which would be me. I see uh, the black Mercedes that's out there, which is Lizzie Grubman's, and all of a sudden you hear this, this gravel being stirred up. And you look up, and you're seeing a car coming backwards. And then it starts to make just basically a beeline right for the entrance. You can't get there fast enough. Words can't come out of your mouth to try to tell the people to move. And 
I sit there and I watch as these people are hit. There's people that are unconscious that are laying all over the place. Uh, there were people to my left strewn about. There were broken limbs. You could see physically. You could see arm uh, arms standing to the side. Uh, there was uh, legs that were like that and just a lot of blood. Uh, it was really quiet for the first 10 seconds afterwards. And then all of a sudden people realized and they just started screaming. And then it was complete pandemonium. Yeah. It was a different story from everyone. Oh, totally I heard I heard there were arms missing. I heard that, like, yeah, I mean, crazy stories. But when I came here, I mean, crazy. there was silence in this house. Like, I walked in, I had this horrendous cab ride. This guy didn't know where he was going. It took me an hour. I was all hyper. I walk in, it's silent in the house. I was online the half hour before she drove through the line, you know? But I wasn't there, but from what I heard from everyone who was there, that, like, it was just when they walked outside and like saw the people out there and the blood and just everything it just it was frightening my gut thing is that she got uh, annoyed and in a rage uh, fit of rage uh, possibly put the uh, vehicle into reverse and back into these people and then after she realized what she'd done she realize that I've done something very serious here. I, my gut thing is that she was just annoyed and did it. <laughs> How much do you think Ron Perlman's house is worth now? It's worth 50 to 75. It's worth 50 to 75 million? Yes, more than that. Have you sold the most expensive house in the Hamptons? Yes. You have? Yes. Have you sold the top two most expensive houses in the They're Hamptons? They're not sold yet. <laughs> Hi. Who was it that's just said hello to me? What? That kid. I don't know. I feel really bad about the conscious point thing. I think it's a I shame. I do, too. I think it is. And I also want to make sure that we understand everything that happened. That parking lot is so darkly lit. There is easily, maybe she was coming around a corner and a whole crowd was running out which that happens, that is that type of crowd that goes there. Yeah, this Lieutenant Brown over Village Police. Could I get a Vermont cheeseburger, extremely well done? Okay, about how long? Okay, thank you, and, and uh, one coffee. Okay, thank you, okay, goodbye. That'll be ready in 20 minutes. The low before the storm. It is, because the fireworks are just about to be starting. 40 minutes, they'll all be trying to get out of the woods on the same road. <laughs> but the problem is, half of them don't know where they are. Well, that's just they they so got there by now. hook or by crook. Now that it gets dark, they haven't got a clue as to where they are. But you only have this road coming out, and then the people here. The first guy out makes a wrong turn. 300 other cars will follow him. Do you know what happened? Yeah, there was a terrible accident. Twelve people were hurt. That's what I heard. Supposedly, she left the scene of the accident. Look at that! Look at that! Whoa! It was so America. Well, this is the American dream. It is. And it's realized by a few, but those who are exposed no, to No, I think the story of the Hamptons is that it's realized by many. This is not a place where you were born with a silver spoon and you have to be a you blue butt. I think everybody at this party made it to made come it. here. Exactly and I right. think that's the new Hamptons. And I think that's why everybody sings God Bless America because and watches the fireworks they like that. Appreciate right, it. exactly. You know. <laughs> Careful driving. I'm not driving. I'm going to Nick and Tony's. Isn't it late to go to Nick and Tony's? Best time. Stay tuned for scenes from the conclusion of The Hamptons here on ABC. Good evening, I'm Katherine Shepherdson. Coming up tonight on News 40, Holyoke Police are investigating an early morning homicide. Mourners remember the 14 victims who died in the Oklahoma Bridge collapse. And tennis fans are serving on soft ground in Springfield. We'll explain coming up on News 40 at 11. From Walt Disney Pictures. Stitch. Lost. Keep quiet. 
if he's listening for us. How good is his hearing? On June 21st, meet the alien. My name Stitch. Who came to Earth to hide out and found a place. Ooh, this is my family. To fit in. Ooh. Disney's Lilo and Stitch, rated PG, in theaters June 21st. You ain't nothing but a hound dog. Ain't no friend of mine. Genital herpes used to get me down. Then I found the power to take charge. I saw my doctor and explored options, like daily suppressive therapy. With suppressive therapy, it's been six months since my last outbreak. These days, I feel a lot better about my life. I'm glad I got information. Suppressive therapy may not work for everyone with genital herpes. Call this number for information about suppressive therapy, then talk to your doctor about treatment options. I've had just one outbreak in 12 months. Call now for information about suppressive therapy. Ah, okay. uh, yes, I'd like a set of Michelin cross terrain SUV tires with white lettering. Please. Now at Sears Auto Center, we're having the biggest Michelin sale of the year at America's Car Care Place. Sears, where else? Imagine what you would do with an extra $100 a day. But if you sign for your purchases whenever you use your Visa check card, you could turn fantasy into reality. Because each time you sign, you'll be entered to win $100 a day for a whole year. Imagine that. The Visa check card. It's everywhere you want to be. So what do you think of Subway's sweet onion chicken teriyaki? Mm. Low fat. Delicious chicken teriyaki topped with a sweet onion sauce. It's one of Subway's two new tastes. This is good. Hard to believe it's low fat. Thank you, whoever you are. You're welcome, whoever you are. Subway is fresh! Unsociable host or unbearable allergies? When seasonal allergies keep you from enjoying the things you do, Allegra can help. Only Allegra has fexofenadine, so unlike many other antihistamines, it won't make you drowsy. And Allegra gives you 24-hour relief. For people 12 and older, side effects are low and may include headache, cold, or back pain. Talk to your doctor today about Allegra and get back to your party. Non-drowsy Allegra. Real relief for real living. Lose the bad stuff. Mm. Keep the good stuff. Ooh, leave soft. Now Nivea brings you Skin Balance Cleansers. The new line of cleansers with the innovative Skin Balance system to selectively target dirt and impurities without harming the natural balance that keeps your skin healthy. Fresh. Radiant. They're the first line of cleansers that work this way. Wow! <laughs> and they're only from Nivea. New Skin Balance Cleansers. Tomorrow night on the Hamptons. I don't know if she's drunk or what. Lizzie's the talk of the town. You call them white trash? No comment. Steven goes to a party. There are so many hot girls here, it makes me wish I was straight. Josh thinks about his future. I would love to fall in love. I've been there, I've done that. <laughs> Let's just say that. Jacqueline finds Mr. Wright. He's got the height, he's got the eyes, he's got all his hair. Think we're in sleepover status? And Billy Joel gives a command performance. <laughs> Tomorrow night at 9, 8 central on ABC. This week, a party fit for a queen. McCartney, Elton, Good Morning America. Live from Buckingham Palace, Queen Elizabeth's Golden Jubilee on Good Morning America. When reality is a feisty mayor, a charismatic principal, an openly gay cop, and a playboy prosecutor, who needs fiction? Think stranding people on an island is riveting? Wait till you see real people run a city. Starting Tuesday, a week-long television event. We don't sugarcoat anything. This is Boston 24-7. The Stanley Cup Finals, Game 3, Saturday night on ABC. Hoyoke police are investigating an early morning stabbing, and airports are urging the government to push back a bag screening deadline. Stay tuned. Your news is next.